hello everyone this is dr meher shah once again with another video in this video we are going to solve problem sums based on reorder level under the subject logistic and supply chain management again a very important video for all the ty bms sem5 student in this video we are going to first note down various formulas that are required to solve reorder level problem sums and thereafter we will be taking up two problem sums in order to clear the concept of you know the reorder level types of sum that can come in your paper so let us see one by one first we will note down the formulas okay now the very first formula that is required is called as safety stock the formula for safety stock is safety stock is equal to daily consumption into period of daily consumption so daily consumption they will tell you in the question uh, 1000 units have been consumed in a day 500 units 400 units 200 units and uh, safety stock will be maintained at two days of consumption three days of consumption so the period will also be given in the question we need to multiply and we get the value of safety stock second we need to find the lead time consumption the formula is daily consumption okay so daily consumption in the safety stock and daily consumption in the lead uh, time consumption they remain the same into the lead time they give you in the question the period also of lead time okay so in your question you are expected to get daily consumption ka units okay the period of daily consumption and the lead time okay once you get that you apply into the formula we give this two values and once you have safety stock and lead time consumption a final answer that is reorder level reorder level that is rol is equal to safety stock that is the answer from the first plus the lead time consumption you add up and whatever answer you get is nothing but your reorder level okay now along with this question you can even they ask you uh, any definitions okay of what is reorder level what is lead time what is safety stock so first you have to you know answer that question and then you need to uh, solve the sum and give it uh, give them in their paper okay चलो लेट अस टेक अप नाउ टू प्रॉब्लम सम बेस्ड ऑन रीऑर्डर लेवल ओके द वेरी फर्स्ट सम आई रीड आउट द क्वेश्चन वन इज गिवन दैट डिफाइंड बफर स्टॉक सेफ्टी स्टॉक लीड टाइम एंड रीऑर्डर स्टॉक लेवल दिस इज व्हाट आई टोल्ड यू ऑल कैन इवन हैव अ यू नो अ थ्योरी काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन एंड देयर आफ्टर दे विल टेल यू टू सॉल्व द सम सो the daily consumption of a raw material in the production process is 500 units so daily consumption is 500 units lead time for delivery is 5 days so the lead time given is 5 days company's policy is to keep a safety stock equal to 2 days of daily consumption the safety stock uh, the period is 2 days of consumption calculate reorder level so first we note down whatever data they have given you so daily consumption is 500 units lead time given was 5 days and period of daily consumption that is the safety stock level ka daily consumption ka is given is 2 days okay now once you get that we first apply the formula for stock level so safety stock level so safety stock ka formula is daily consumption into period of daily consumption so daily consumption is 500 unit period is 2 days so a uh, solution will be 500 into 2 which is equal to 1000 units that is step 1 second step you need to find the lead time consumption the so formula is lead time consumption is equal to daily consumption into lead time the daily consumption is 500 units and the lead time is 5 days so 500 into 5 comes to 2500 Once we have both the answers, now we can directly apply into our final value. So reorder level is equal to safety stock plus lead time. So that is thousand unit plus two thousand five hundred. So total comes to three thousand five hundred units. Okay. So this is how you all had to solve the problem sum based on reorder level. They'll give you those three things which are required. Apply into the formula and get the final answer. Okay, I hope everyone have understood this first sum. Okay, I'll give you a couple of seconds so you all can just note it down, and then we'll jump to the second sum based on reorder level.
okay let's let us take the next question it is given that define safety stock level and what are the factors on which safety stock level depends and then they have given you the question the daily consumption of a raw material in the production process is 600 units so daily consumption is 600 unit the lead time for delivery is four days so the lead time given is four days and company's policy is to keep a safety stock equals to four days daily consumption to guard the uh, guard against the stock out calculate reorder level again first we will note down the data so daily consumption 600 unit lead time is four days and daily time period is also four days so i have written here daily consumption 600 units lead time four days and period for daily consumption is also four days first step we need to find the stock level or the safety stock level formula is daily consumption 600 into the period of daily consumption which is four days 600 into 4 comes to 2400 units okay so that is our step number one next we need to find the lead time so lead time consumption is daily consumption 600 into the lead time four days 600 into 4 comes to 2400 Once we have got both these values, we can apply into the final answer. Reorder level is safety stock 2400 units plus lead time 2400 units. Total comes to 4800 units. Okay, I hope everyone have got this. Very simple sum, you just have to apply the formulas and substitute the values. And you need to learn the theoretical part a little bit uh, along with this what will be asked. Okay. So this is it. Uh, under reorder level, three formulas are required to be learned. Safety stock, lead time consumption and the reorder level itself. Okay, so with that we will be able to solve any kind of sum based on reorder level. I hope everyone have understood this. Okay, so you can note down this and then thereafter we can you know, put an end to this video. Okay. Chalo. So I hope everyone have understood this. With that we will be ending this video here. Thank you.